Hey guys, so I am watering Dottie, my polka dot begonia, and I water her from the bottom. And so I just wanted to show you guys what I'm doing. Um, so I'm gonna flip the camera around here. So I have this little dish. Um, I actually had cooked dinner in it, um, and I do this a lot. Um, I'll rinse it out real well, and then I'll put the water in the bottom. And if you can see, there's water down here. So what I do is I just put some lukewarm water in the bottom and then I, I take her, this is the pot that she was in. Um, there's no hole in the bottom. It's just a little pretty pot that um, she came in. And so I just stick her in here. She's got holes down here at the bottom. Let me grab this a different way. See, she's got holes down here. So I just stick her in water and I'm just gonna let her sit for about 10 minutes or so. Um, I actually put a little bit more water in cause she soaked it up super quick. So I think she was really thirsty. Um, but this is how I bottom water um, a bunch of my plants that really seem to prefer the bottom watering. And you can actually see some new growth on her right here and here, as well as down here. There's also a nice little growth right here and over here. But look at her gorgeous spots. Um, she is one of my favorites. I just absolutely adore her. Um, and she does prefer the bottom watering. Um, once I started bottom watering, that's when all these shoots um, started to come up and I actually did not do rainwater today just because um, I didn't think about it and I just put in tap water but she doesn't seem to mind either way um, some of my plants prefer rainwater to tap water but so far I haven't really noticed um, that Dottie cares too much um, probably next time I'll water her with rainwater but I just wanted to show you guys how I bottom water my plants.